The knowledge that you get from this course and the confidence you get from it uh, is invaluable. You know, it's really important that everybody has this kind of knowledge because we never know uh, when we're going to be in an emergency situation in a remote area. We'll have to give someone help even though we're not a, a medical professional. I'm Dean, I'm a flight nurse midwife at CareFlight in Darwin and I also have the privilege to coordinate some of the uh, Medistim trauma care workshops and sick and injured kids in the bush. We get first responders from a variety of organisations and we basically build on first aid and show them how to do life-saving interventions for the trauma patient. So things like maintaining an airway, controlling haemorrhage and moving a patient to either a safer location or to a location where they can get, the help can get to them quicker. It's important because the NT is a really big place, it's sparsely populated and help can be a long way away. The people who get there first are often the people that we, are the people that we train and they're very much the difference between life and if not death, permanent disability for trauma patients. With these tail ends you can then tie it into position or you can get another crate bandage, tie it around, cable ties, whatever you need to to hold that into position. Yeah, a lot of things that we learned today were scenarios that I have been involved in already and I can see myself being involved in again, like car accidents and things like that. And I found that um, yeah, what we learned today is something that I could will be used again. At some point in your life you're going to probably see one of these incidents or scenarios. So I think nearly everyone that does a first aid course should probably do this one.